Hello, lovely people of the internet. Uh, my name is Allard. Welcome back to Firewatch episode 7 already. And uh, we, uh, where we left off was uh, me being scared. <laughs> because uh, it's it's uh, starting to uh, to uh, get weird. Um, I don't know if, if um, our guy is hallucinating or that there is some weird shit going on. But, uh, but yeah, it's, uh, it's, 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 there's some weird shit, well, there is a weird shit going on, we've already <laughs> decided on that, um, but exactly what kind of weird shit's going on is still, uh, is still unknown, so, I'm uh, very curious to see where this is going. We are currently on our way to, uh, what was it called, Wapiti Station? Wapiti Meadow? Uh, which is where the Iron Fence was, um, there's a rock stack over here. Um, but yeah. Definitely weird stuff. Um, somebody knocked us unconscious. As far as we know. Um, somebody has been keeping track of the conversation I had with... Um, Delilah. Which is... Very concerning. <laughs> which is the reason why I was starting to get scared. Um... And then we found their walkie-talkie, and when we did, they uh, they uh, gave us a good bang on the head. Down. Ooh, interesting. Okay, okay, okay. So there's the fence. Can I walk up this bit? Or am I gonna fall to my death if I do that? Anything interesting to spot? Not yet. Oh, there's a gate in the fence. I'm okay, here. Okay, I'm at the fence. I don't see anyone around, but I'm not sure I can get past it. How big is it? Big. It goes it's off in both size. directions. Acres. But what the fuck is going on out here? Whatever it is, someone doesn't want anyone to know about it. Uh. Sometimes biologists will cordon off a little area to study flora or whatever, but yeah. that's only a few square feet usually. That's not what this is. <sighs> We'll see what you can do to get past it. First of all, another rock stack. Looks like goddamn Area 51. <laughs> Maybe they've got aliens. That'd be exciting. No, it wouldn't we'll be. I'm about that. shitting my pants. But uh, we gotta... This guy's making so much noise. I'm on edge. <laughs> and what are the odds they left the gate unlocked? Pretty low, I'd imagine. Now they know I'm go <laughs> go Look, trying to get in. Gonna be able to get into this place. Oh, shit. I I don't know how long I can dick around out here until someone notices. God, if you were an actual firefighter, you'd have that gate down in two shakes. Yeah. Hey, actually, those guys doing the controlled burn—they might be able to help. Oh, where are they? Beyond Ruby River, there's a scout camp. They burned a line a few days ago that should let you hike right to them. Okay. Well, that's great. If they haven't left, they're probably the type of guys who would help you get through that fence. Okay. Look for controlled burn south of Ruby River. We are here. Ruby River was that one. Ooh, so we got a uh, a long hike has got ahead of us. So what would be a good trail to do? Let's see. I mean, we can't go down there. So I guess we take a lake trail, if we can, and then we go down to H307. Um, yeah, that, se that seems to be the way. I mean, we could also follow Thunder Canyon. Uh, we could do that, but that means going through the cavern again, and the cavern gives me more, <laughs> more stress than I need. <laughs> Um, so, yes, we are going to go down. Uh, we came from, uh, around here. Yeah. All right. We out here again. 
game is definitely starting to make me feel uneasy. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, there's another one of those rock sex. Totally not weird. Nope. They didn't sabotage my rope, didn't they? You never know. Hey, here it goes. Slow and steady wins the race. I'm so scared of just like climbing up and then being face to face with somebody <laughs> who wants to knock me unconscious. Uh, let's go the long way around. That way I'm less likely to uh, make a mistake while navigating. But yeah, I am like, as I said, I'm a scaredy cat when it comes down to games like this uh when shit starts to get weird and you don't know what to expect um but on the other hand i'm just very intrigued where this is going um so i'm definitely i don't mind this happening <laughs> it's just ooh. normally i wouldn't really play these games on my own but uh why the hell not it makes for a more genuine experience. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Just... Some forced sounds. So. We are heading back. And we are going to go all the way... Up, 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 up. To my own tower. Take a breather at my tower. That music. I would like the game to... Uh, Announce to me I'm when they start playing music. Of the lake. Which way is Ruby River? It's in the southeast corner of your map. The scout camp where the firefighters were staged should be on your map. It looks like a little triangle with a flat bottom. Yeah, it looks like a tent. How did I never see that before? What's this little nook? Is that? Hello, boy. Can I zoom in? Pears, pears, pears. Yes. Are you okay? Are you okay? You didn't just have a stroke, did you? No. You smell burnt toast? <laughs> <laughs> no. Then what then? What I'm doing that? a crossword and I figured out the theme. It's homonyms. Pears, oh. pears, pears. The clue was couples peeling fruit. <laughs> anyway, hope you're having a good afternoon. Thanks. Thank you. Now I couldn't report the, the raccoon. I messed up. I needed to take a picture instead of talking with her about it. Sad. It's okay. <laughs> he didn't drop anything, did he? Oh, it was just chilling. This boy be chilling. Hey, climb back up. So, just a little bit of dialogue we just got. Was that the little alcove that we were in? Yes, but there seems to be... Another little alcove right besides it. What's up with that? Is there some kind of cavern around here? Let's see. No, oh, that's already too far. It's like. Hmm. Would be behind this spot. Oh. Is this it? Can't, can't climb when I have a map in my hand, I understand. Where's this? This is back at that little spot. Hmm. Hmm. What if I want to get on top of that? Is that even supposed to be? 
Oh, can I look over it? Nope. Barely. Hmm. Into the thick of it. Into the thick of it. <laughs> Down. I go through here. No. Hmm. I'm determined to find a way through Some dirt. Oh, me. Hmm. All right. Well, whatever it is, it's not ready for me yet. Okay. We are heading back, and this time, I wanted to say this time without any detours, but yeah, there don't look to be too many detours. Although, kind of want to visit Castrio Six and then see what that little alcove is over there. If any. Unless I get knocked out once more. That would be... That would be not fun. <laughs> uh, are we going down? Nope. Are we going that way? Is that it? Or is that going back up? No, this seems to be the right way. Hey, I called around. Things seem normal with everyone else. Okay, well, that's uh, anything strange with you? Has anything strange been happening on your end? Yeah. No, nothing really. Okay. Nothing really or nothing? Nothing. My door was open the other night, but that's not strange. That doesn't sound like nothing. It's nothing, I promise. Mm. All right, I'm headed toward the camp anyway. Okay. Okay. Keep your radio close to you. Nope. Hey, well, you just said keep my radio close to me yeah before i got attacked back at the lake i saw a radio on the ground kind of like the one i use mm -hmm. and do you think that maybe someone was you know uh i don't know what build beans failing me yeah me, following me around like working with other people henry you are way too much of a dope to be in the mob <laughs> Someone is clearly able to hear us sometimes, and was hiding near the uh -huh. lake. Come on. I, I, I just. Just admit it. You're a little worried. Of course, I'm worried. But let's just try to keep things calm, okay? Keep things on it's an even weird. keel. It's, it's very weird, even I would say. The music starting again. I know we don't know what's going on yet, but I don't have a good feeling. I don't like feeling vulnerable. It's not like you can just call the police. I was thinking about the good ones. It just struck me that if anything weird like this happened to them, happened to Brian, just how scared he would have been. Well, gee, thanks. He had his dad to protect this him. Isn't really helping me. Ned, right? Yeah. You don't think he could? No, you're you're probably right. It, it was three years ago. He's in high school now. He's on summer break. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Am I right though? I don't know what to what to believe anymore. Wait, have you been through this little alcove? Feels a little bit familiar, at least. Then you drop down here. Oh, okay. And that drops you off at the medicine wheel. Right. Have I visited the medicine wheel? Why not? Let's let's break our ankles. Ugh! Such a long drop. Uh, so we are heading down here. Towards the medicine wheel. Yeah. Look, I haven't been to the medicine wheel yet. Wow, there's an old, um, I think it's called a cool. medicine wheel out here. Yeah, it was made by Crow American Indians hundreds of years ago. There are lots of small ones, um, 
Have you ever been to Medicine Wheel Monument over in the Bighorns? This is a pretty big one, though. I sure haven't. Well, it's worth a three-hour detour on the way home in August. Uh, neat. I'll keep it in mind. Pretty cool. All right. Uh, so now we are heading east. That way. Wait, then we just come from there? Yeah, probably. That's how. <laughs> that's how directions work. So yeah, we are heading up there. With a bit of luck, we could, might get to just barely wave at our tower. It's there. It's... here or oh, I shouldn't be joking about that I'm gonna find a body and freak the fuck out <laughs> yeah if you if you notice that my my commentary has been a bit um, less enthusiastic I'm I'm really enjoying the game but it's getting to be <laughs> so there's nothing in there old very old going keep on going uh, okay so we go down here and then we should have some kind of fence another small fence uh, is it down here is this the way down yep it is All right Very good, very nice. Hey, there's a cache. Which is much appreciated. Let's see if we have some more. Oh, we got some parkour! Parkour, parkour! Yep. The June? Oh, this was where the fire was. Yeah, okay, okay. Makes sense. Uh, one, two, Three, four. We got some more information. That's always nice. It's a lending library. So we got some books. One chance to die. Jane Eyre. 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 Accidental savior. Terminal seven. Toilet paper. That's always nice. Uh, okay. Wanna. See if there's anything underneath there. Nope. Underneath there. Okay. Don't be so rough with books, Jesus. Come back. And then what are you? Run! Really wish the power that uh, the powers that be could issue as radios that didn't suck ass. Most of the time, I'd prefer to keep thing pen and paper, but every once in a while, I'd, I'd be nice to get a hold of you right away. My sister keeps leaving me messages on the main office, but I don't think she gets that I took the job, so I wouldn't have to deal with her. Or mom. I've been sitting at a spot for a while now, thinking about what to say to her, but I'm a quarter way through this bottle of... Fifies? Fifies? Instead, miss you, Dave. Oh. Alright. Well, the June fire isn't going anywhere, huh? No, that's why those guys came out to burn that line. It's at the stage where all we can do is pay attention to it. Okay. They're not gonna try to put it out? Not yet, apparently. Hey. But so we are entering. Creepy. I found where they did the controlled burn. I can hike right through here now. Hell yeah, let's yeah, go. Normally they wouldn't do that so close to a body of water, but I think they're extra worried about a fire jumping the river and burning up to two forks now that there's someone in it. 
Fair. Well, I'm extra appreciative of that. Let's see. <laughs> the scout camp is southeast of the river. There should be a pond on the way. Got it. Uh, is that the way we're supposed to be going? East, and we are looking east. Hmm. I mean, I could also walk back and have a little look at the uh, other cache. But I'm too curious. I want to see what's up with this. What is this? What happens if burn what gets out of control? What happens if a burn gets out of control? Someone gets fired. Okay. Uh, Fire. Are you serious? <laughs> oh, come on. That one was an honest accident. I'm not even in the mood for wordplay. That's how wound up all this shit has me. I get it. Signpost. Uh, there's an old pond out here. Not much more than a pile of mud. Uh, do, do you have it on your map? Ah, uh, yeah. I know where you are. Yeah? Where am I? Pork Pond. There used to be a sign up for it, but, um... Well, folks kept stealing it. Fair. <laughs> uh, because it's called Pork Pond? Yep. It's a good goddamn name. That sign would look great in a den. Or... It would. You know, anywhere. There's some old snowmobiles out here. That's crazy. It looks like one of the poor bastards was cruising across Old Pork Pond and dumped it. That was not a fun hike back to civilization. It's a snowmobile. Oh, well, maybe they use it during the winter. Oh, someone stripped these snowmobiles down to the bone. Huh. And that's hmm. weird, right? I mean, I can come up with a bunch of not weird reasons someone would do that out here, but... Given what's happened, yeah. Yeah, that's weird. It's a little weird. It's a little unsettling. I guess... Oh, I can just walk through the pond. Another wrecked snowmobile. Anything out of the ordinary? Oh, all seems relatively normal, at least. Besides the fact that they are here. Mm, camp... Arafeo? Arifa <laughs> Pork pump. Lovely. So yeah. This way. I'm stuck. Right. Oh, this is... Camp Arapaho. Arapaho! <laughs> yeah, I am. <sighs> it's been out there since the 50s. I was never really into the idea of the scouts. It's something about men organizing boys around their ideals. Never sat right with me. Oh, yeah, some Beware good uh in large numbers. Beware of anyone in large numbers. I like the, the way he thinks. The bridge to the camp is out. Damn. I'm yeah. going to walk the ravine and see if I can find some high ground to get across. Good plan. All right. All righty then. Making our way around. See if we can uh, find any other way to cross. Oh, I can long drop down. What if I don't want to do that just yet? I could go up there. I don't know if that's gonna give me anything interesting. That would stress me out, but you know, it's always good to explore some more. Explore some more. Explore some more. Hmm. There seems to be too much out here. Uh, okay. Then we will go back to that place that we can hop off. It's a big ass smokestack. Right. So. Whoa! Hold on there. Uh, so, yeah, we are going to go up here and then drop down over here. Yeah! We don't need to report it. Some cool ass totem pole. Sweet. Let's follow the path. There's an old building. Have you ever talked to any of the scouts? No, they haven't been out here in a while, and I generally don't have a lot to say to preteens. Unless it's Brian Goodwin. Fair. Well, if forced, I mean. I can make conversation with anyone. Plus, it was sort of fun to hear about all of his nerdy hobbies. Mm. 
Like what? What type of nerdy hobbies are we talking about with him? Like uh, marching band? D and D? Oh no 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 no! Like comics, model rockets, wizards and wyverns. You know. <laughs> oh. Hey, thanks to Brian, I can almost recall by memory the armor classes of most dragons. The what? No, you can't. Nice. Hey, planar dragons armor class. Let's see. Okay, no, I believe you. We're good. <laughs> We're good. Uh, I guess these little shelters are where they keep the weeblos. For the past 35 years, yeah. Hmm. Anything else interesting around here? Bear trap. There are bear traps out here in the scout shelters. Scouts are stalwart prey. That's messed up. Another missing poster. Hmm. Totally not concerning. 10 to 1? Why do I look like bodies? Okay, so it's about somebody killing. You know, I'm just gonna leave that right there. You know, that's fine. I think I can see through these gaps. Thing crazy. I don't like that that book was there. But hey, I don't like most things that make me feel uneasy. <laughs> oh god. Why am I playing this game? Because it's good. That's why I'm playing this game. Oh. Yeah, these guys are gone. I found where they were sitting around before getting picked up. Damn. However. Uh, an axe. I found an axe. If one of the crew left it, that thing is actually called a Pulaski. It looks oh. like an axe to me. This thing will be a huge help. For both it. getting through the backcountry and getting through that fence. I can now defend myself. Feel a little bit safer. Now I am the axe. <gasps> I am the axe murderer. I'm the axe murderer that the girls warned me about. The backside of the... Yeah. Hmm. Anything else? I saw a note on the ground, on the stump. A memo. Hmm. Hey, D, they left something behind. It's uh, like a memo from their boss. Did it say anything of note? Uh, next few days, dropping into the thoroughfare on behalf of Dr. Simmons at Wapiti Station. Wapiti Station? Holy crap. Keep reading. Oh, I just thought I would maybe, you know, stop there, let the mystery percolate. <laughs> my mother always said I would meet someone who'd give me a taste of my own medicine. <laughs> They're running a research site out there. Uh, he was worried about wildfires. Someone is writing down our conversations. And now we find out there's a research site out here that, that, that we don't know about? What are they researching? Yeah. Us. us. They're researching us. You, you think they're studying you and me? I do, yeah. I mean, maybe it's about... Studying two strangers who talk every day. Like, if you put that's... someone in isolation with someone else, what they do. Oh, God. Yeah, that's what I think. Well, fuck that. Yeah. Agreed. I think we should allow for the possibility that this is all just a big misunderstanding, but... Mm. God, if you saw what you said you did... Fuck, Henry. Yeah, I it's saw it. definitely okay. a bit weird. So what's next? Well, I've got an axe, so I can figure out a way to get over the ravine and back towards the site. True. Sounds good. Check in when you can, and keep an eye out for anyone following you. Yes, I will. I don't like that she's told me that. All right. From Squad Boss Grant Carson, Wyoming Interagency Hotshot Crew, Paint Rock Ranger Districts, uh, Rat Dr. Simmons at Wapiti Station, Thoroughfare Region. Squad Boss Carson, in the next few days, you and your team will be dropping into the Thoroughfare Region of Shoshone National Forest to cut a fire line south of Ruby River. I'm writing on behalf of Dr. Ben Simmons at Wapiti Station. He reached out to the superintendent with wildfire concerns about his research site. Upon your return, someone from his office will want to speak with you as part of a wildfire risk assessment of the region. I told them that they have nothing to worry about and that your team's fire lines are the most potent preventative measure in protecting their sites, even though they'll be more than a mile away. But I think they've got insurance companies to answer to. Thanks as always for your service, Rich Lusarenko, Assistant Superintendent. All right. Let's uh, cut our way through here. 
Hell yeah. I'm free! <laughs> Nothing will stop me now. Uh, okay. This basically puts me on the other side of the ravine. Oh, hell yeah. There we go. Top, top, top. No, don't have to. Go on, hop over it. Hell yeah. <laughs> All right. And uh, with that, where are we going? Return to Wapiti Meadow. Why can't we do that? You know, um, and it's day. <laughs> uh, but we're definitely gonna explore that in the next episode. Um, are you there? I I had a thought. Let's hear it. You heard someone in the bushes. Yeah. Okay, so let's assume we're being tailed. Or you are, at least. Where are you right now? Just on my way back. I, in and out why is the audio cutting out? Nowhere. Do you see anybody? No, definitely not. All right. So, uh, tell me what you think of this. <laughs> Did you just cough? No. Did you just cough? No. Oh, oh fuck. fuck. Um, there isn't any way someone, like, another lookout could be on this line, is there? No. Not without tapping our radios. Uh. Get in your tower. Shut the door. Don't leave and don't use your radio. I'll call you. Understand? I will call you. Oh! No, 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 no! <sighs> don't like it, don't like it, don't like it! Oh, fuck. Make me very, very uncomfortable. Oh, he is very comfortable. Bear Tower, this is Two Forks calling you for the, oh, 50th time today. No, she was gonna call me. The June fire continues to move in a southerly fashion. Delilah, for fuck's sake, answer your radio. Hello, sunshine. Sorry, went out for a little bit. What can I do you for? Uh, are you so chipper? I a wink last night, and I've been going crazy for the past six hours of sunup. How are you so chipper? Well, it's a new day. What a day, this day we've been given. Maybe I am actually asleep right now. Maybe I didn't stay up all night knowing that someone is... I actually slept just great. Uh, okay. By the way, I was wondering if your flora of the Shoshone info poster was still up inside your tower? What? It's just protocol that those stay up. You know, info about your tower, the surrounding tree species, etc. Uh, uh, all right. Just, you know, have a look at it. Make sure it's in ship shape. Hey. Okay, yeah, it's up. Why are you acting like this? Great. Just wonderful. Do you see the tree in the top row, second from the left? Sure. It's the, uh... No. You don't need to tell me. Just, um, internalize it. It's, it's a great tree. And there's an area called, um, that tree's name in your sector that maybe you should take a midday hike to. Maybe. Oh, uh, I'm catching yeah. on. Okay, um, maybe I should go for a hike. Nothing like an afternoon in the Rockies, I tell you. Radio me the moment you get there. Okay. So we have. What are we looking for? Cotton. Cotton wood. Ox rest. Hmm. Scout camp, pork pond, medicine wheel, mule point, ox rest. Am I blind? Campfire smoke, Cottonwood Creek. There it is. Okay. Okay. So that is where we're heading next episode. Um. Oh, I'm shivering. Um. We're gonna figure out why the Lila is uh, acting so strange. Well, she probably feels the same way about this whole situation as we are. Or, 
I don't know. Maybe Delilah is in on it. Uh... Oh, he took off his wedding ring. There we go. But yeah, uh, that's for the next episode. <laughs> so... <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this episode. I really appreciate uh, your eyeballs. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, I'll see you in the in the next episode. Please like, comment, subscribe, do all that stuff if you are enjoying this comment, or if you simply like seeing me scared, <laughs> whatever you're you're into. I don't judge. Uh, and uh, and yeah, that'll do it <laughs> for, for, for this episode. Um, see you by the next one. Bye.